understand that Boko Haram elements are taking control of some communities in the northeast region. What could be the cause of this? And could this be a setback in the fight against insurgency in the northeast region? Not really, but there are some communities normally when the insurgents um, you know, attack and they hold on to it because of the a uh, number, insufficient number of soldiers we have on ground, like the experience we had in Damasak, uh, and the same experience that we had in Gaidam recently, the same thing that happened in Minok, and uh, even in uh, Wulgo, where the soldiers, or even in Dupa recently, the soldiers will have to withdraw tactically and come back with reinforcement, and normally they normally succeed. Now, before then, uh, it's, it's, it's natural for the insurgents to hold on like they did in, uh, in uh, Gaidam and even preaching, have time to preach uh, to the people. And they, once they have infiltrated the, the community, uh, then the Air Force is uh, incapacitated because they can't bomb anywhere. You know, uh, they, they will have collateral damage. But uh, it is not like they hold on to a particular place permanently, no. And uh, this, uh, this is an insurgency where they do hit and run. And sometimes they do hit with a purpose. Like now, what they are trying to do is because the hit is on, with the, 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 uh, the new army command is putting a hit on them. They too are desperate in getting arms and ammunition. Um, so most of the arms and ammunition they use are the ones that they, they succeed in cutting away from uh, uh, the Nigerian soldiers and other armed, uh, uh, and uh, under for armed forces or security agencies. I don't believe. I know that there are some small arms coming from up there, like Libya, Chad, and all that. But most, the bulk of their, uh, the, 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 the equipments they use are the ones that they succeed in stealing from uh, the, our armed, armed forces. And this is what the new forces are trying to guide against. Uh, if the Nigerian army, I believe, I'm working with them closely, I still say it, let's give the Nigerian army and armed forces what they need in order to end this insurgency and other forms of criminality within the shortest possible time. That way you can call them in, give them timeline, and if they don't do it within that timeline, you can show them the way out.